Angie Horkin is here from the Beef Council, cooking up a storm. Yay! Good to see you again. You too. We missed you last month. What are we, we're talking heart healthy and beef. Yeah. Some people don't always put those two together. No, they don't. But we do have a great nutrition message. We have a lot, a lot of lean cuts, and beef is leaner than it used to be. Mm. Um, so we have 29 cuts of beef that have about one more gram of saturated fat than a skinless chicken breast, which people don't know about and we like to talk about that and we have a lot of great free information for viewers. You got two new recipe books out. Yes, yes, this is the American Heart Association's recipes for the heart mm -hmm. and then we have this power for your plate with great beef recipes and also um, easy tips to incorporate activity into to your lifestyle because um, one of the main messages for a heart healthy lifestyle is activity. Mm -hmm. At least 30 minutes a day. Right. Is what they like to say. So a lot of great tips in there, and then a lot of great recipes. All right, and you got a couple of them here. Yes, I do. I have two today. This is called a calypso beef soup, and it's really good this time of year because it's got sweet potato in it and spinach, and it's a nice fall dish. All good stuff. And it uses uh, coconut milk. Really? Mm -hmm. hmm. And 95% lean ground beef, and then black-eyed peas. So very high in protein and with all the vegetables, very high in vitamins and minerals. And then with the lean ground beef, which is one of the skinny 29 cuts, mm -hmm. um, it's a great, very nutritious meal. It smells great. Yeah. And over here. And over here, we're grilling a steak. I have a top sirloin, which is also one of the 29 cuts. And we put a little bit of marinade on it. We just made a simple marinade with olive oil, vinaigrette, cilantro, garlic and paprika okay and we marinated the top sirloin for about an hour so top sirloin's tender you do not need to marinate for tenderness just for flavor in, so in the bag in the fridge for an hour in the, exactly okay. 15 minutes to two hours is what we say and then we're also grilling red peppers and a little bit of baguette bread and this recipe is called tapa style pepper steak parfait so okay fancy we, name. yeah we have some different kind of glasses that we put fresh spinach in and we're going to top the spinach with some steak because this can be served as an appetizer in a fancy glass like this or as a meal, as a salad. So we'll just make one quick slice up our top sirloin which up here. And then we're going to top it with some Spanish olives or just, just cut up green, green chopped olives and then fresh cilantro. Boy, it's, uh, everything's good so far. Yeah. And then it calls for a manchego cheese, which is a Spanish hard cheese, but I couldn't find that. So um, I used an Asiago, which I think will be okay. All right. And then we're going to top it with a baguette. And then also, if we had time, we'd top it with a little bit of this grilled red pepper. Just cut it up and... Just cut it up and top it right on. And so you have a complete meal right here in a parfait glass. And, and heart healthy. Yes, very. Boy, it looks great. All right, and they can get these online? Yeah, well, the, I would say the best way to get these is to call us, 1-800-728-BEEF, and leave your name and your mailing address. Or if you do go to beeftips.com on the home page, there is, um, right on the left side, there's an email address. And you can email us, wbc at beeftips.com, and we will mail these free. All right. Lots of great recipes. Angie, thanks again. We'll see you in a month.